you know, just when you think that Vince McMahon is feeling the biggest pressure of his career when it comes to AEW. And you know what? I knew at some point this was wasn't going to be a surprise for me because each time when a wrestler cuts a good promo, Kevin Dunn and Vince McMahon will always want to find something to cry about. And this is no obsession, y'all. So they got mad because Becky Lynch cut a decent promo on Tuesday of SmackDown. Um, when she went on to talk about how Oscar won the last year's Royal Rumble and she lost at WrestleMania. Yeah, she's all talk about the hype and stuff. Then Oscar comes out and say that, you know, you're not going to be living in Charlotte's shadow. She's going to be living in hers. And then the most boring group ever, the Iconics. Boring promo. I swear, who let these two idiots, you know, in the main roster? They were never that interesting anyway to me because all I see is just a bunch of corny jokes that are not funny at all. Every time they talk on the mic, it's just not funny. I mean, seriously, who let these two in, in, you know, in the main roster? So, you're basically getting mad at Becky Lynch for, for cutting a decent promo on Oscar. Because you claim that she's pandering. I did not see anybody pandering whatsoever. All I heard and saw was a wrestler cutting a decent promo. And I've seen some comments on Facebook saying that her promos are better than Roman Reigns. What was she pandering about? I don't want to stand what's going on with Vince McMahon now. I think it is because of AEW. They're feeling the pressure. This man is scared. He's feeling the pressure. He's. It's just ridiculous, man. So. But let me tell you something. Kevin Dunn needs to go. His camera work is weak. It's causing people to get seizures. I mean, seizures. Dizzy. And, bruh, Psh, this company is so full of sensitive people. And it's one thing of booing the new day and, their, and, and you know, uh, the fag day uh, and their gay and generous when it comes to their gimmicks and stuff. But it's another to want to badge on a wrestler who is one of the best right now, who cut a decent promo and you're getting mad at her because you claim that she's pandering. I didn't I did not see any panderings whatsoever. I don't know what PG pipe Bisman Man them was smoking on, but they better they about to check themselves into a rehab or something because y'all scared. Just admit it. Hands down.